Hello, this is Sophie Lawson from sophielawson.com and this is another click look video where we clearly look at various art books and the little girl's come out today, little kitty the cat she's come out because we're going to be looking at issue number well, volume number 7 of the Digital Painting Techniques book and these are little books by 3D Total Publishing and this is volume number 7 which apparently is going to be focused a bit more on pinups, which we can't wait for that. We've looked at numbers 1, 2 and 8 before. And these are really cool little books. I feel like you're going to learn tons from these books if you read them. But they're also inspiring just to sort of go through them and look at them. So you're getting the best of both worlds, I think. If you want to learn things, you can learn things. But if you just want to be inspired, you can also be inspired which is quite nice and this one has got a little bit of a texture on the techniques little things like <laughs> I love that sound little things like that I always love that sort of thing so this is on the back that looks nice it's like um I think I've seen that before I feel like I have that's cool as well but when when did this one come out oh little kitty's got to open it that's one of the rules. Boing! A nice little green. Green and brown. What's she doing look? <laughs> she can go down there I think. These are your two little... Who are they? <laughs> oh look. It's quite cool. I like this. Th th these books are always full of little faces as well. Of all the artists and all the people who make it. I love that green. He sitting in his little car. 2015 this one was. It's only five years old. It's not too old. So what have we got in here then? We've got vehicles. Boring. They're starting out with the boringness. They're starting out with the vehicles. I always find... Oh, this is cool. Look. We've, after the vehicles, we've got a stylized female characters. Can't wait for that. Pinup girls with a pinup racing car driver. I, lo I love Formula One. Mixing Formula One and or racing cars and girls. That's cool. Speed painting techniques. Mythological creatures. That'd be fun. Map painting and then environments. So it starts out with the boring vehicles and it ends with the <laughs> boring environments. And then we have little Dennis's favourite. Da 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 da. The gallery. That's going to be fun. Oh, I like this look. Little creatures. What are we starting out with? Vehicles. This is a little introduction. I like that. Little monsters. I really like that. Yeah, the baby. there was a lot of destruction in the other one as well. In, in, book, in volume number two. Lots of destruction. That's quite cool. That's like um, Borderlands. A strong vehicle design should be no less full of character than your characters. That's quite... Um, I feel like they're saying that to me. So that the, the cars, the vehicles can have character. Yeah, that's quite fun. I don't know, I just I just prefer characters. I don't know why. I wonder why that is. Very nicely laid out this book. You can just see how much information's in here. You get little tips as well. Which is cool. Little tips. That is like borderlands that. Imagine if the world ends up like this. I think that'd be quite fun. It would be depressing maybe, but fun. Because I think what happened is everyone would actually come together. That's quite cool, that. And I do like this. I do like the little sketches. It's quite f it is fun. It's just not as fun as characters. But for me. A very interesting shape that one. 
He is really funny sat in that. Oh, look at this letter. All these little... That's cool. Yeah. It's just, that is, that is amazing, that. All little designs. It's really weird. I love Formula One and I love the shapes of Formula One cars. But I wonder why I've never really got into... I've never tried it, though. I'm, I'm judging character, designing character vehicles without actually having done it. Maybe I should try it. See what it feels like. That's cool. Right. Nice effects going on. Uh, you can just tell there's lots of information here. Cool. Look, it shows you how you get a different feeling by changing colour balance, sharpening, light in the layer, and then you've got little filters, soft light, a soft light filter. Cool. Very interesting, the shapes that they come up with. I like that. Little digger again. We had a digger in one of the other ones. That mysterious person, he's got no face. <laughs> he's, a, he's a robot. He's, the artist is an AI. Little man is just a like a little silhouette. Some nice stuff going on there. Look, little squiggles. Look at him, look. He's just he's nothing. He's just a little silhouette. Just enough information to. He's very important though. If he wasn't there, it would it would lose quite a lot of the feeling. It's quite interesting, that. Yay! Little stylized female characters. We've got free resources as well. You can download free resources. Oh weird, look at her little feet there. That's weird. It's like her feet are her hands. Very weird, huh? Research and develop a to a unique brief. That's a nice silhouette. Very pretty. Yeah, I love I love when you see the character coming together. She's almost a little bit like a sort of yeah, like a sort of lizard, like a lizard lazy lady. I like that. Oh, cool! Create a stunning ballerina. Very pretty. Little quotes as well, look. Titties, textures, more defined, less defined, focus. Pro tip, learning by observing. Whenever I'm not in front of my computer working on some painting, I'm somewhere studying the world around me. Yeah, I said that in one of the articles on the podcast. It's almost like the drawing process never stops. It's quite cool. I like that. Maybe we've 
got you a look. Quite a period drama female. Little pushes. Blends into the background. Yeah, blends in, look. Nice texture. Oh, I like this one, look. Paint Helen of Troy. Nice. Oh, look at these over here, look. Cool. I like that pose. I love that pose as well. Little thumbnails. She looks cool, look. Reminds me a little bit of lightning from Final Fantasy VII. That pose is... Oh, look, you've got a head here. It's quite interesting. She's sitting on the heads... Heads of, like, gods or something. Yeah. That's pretty. Oh, I like that. Really like that. So they start out with traditional. Yeah, and they're going to scan it in. And then clean it up. Interesting. Hmm. I like that. Hey, little pin-up girls. She looks fun. Hey, I've seen that's yeah, Christy Lara. She's one of my. She got. I got one of her artworks in inspirational section on my website. I love her. She did a really nice one of poison ivy. Little gestures. Oh, cool. She, Yay, she did the racing one. Yeah, that's fun, that. <laughs> that is cool. It's kind of like old-fashioned-y. Sort of 70s vibe. Like a retro racer. I like that. Cool. Seen her somewhere before. There's that little little thumbnails. That looks cool. Black and white. I like her. I like her shapes. That's cool as well. Reference images for research. Wonder if that's her model no Stacy. She got a professional model to pose for. Her. Cool. Look, see it all building up. Oh, I really like that. Yeah, yeah, you can get all the little tips for the hair as well. Yay, pretty, look, it's going to be making pretty hair. Cool, they've really taken this one apart. That might be my favourite, I think. I love the pose. Of the colours, cool character as well. Oh yes, I love her. Look at the little bird, look. I like that little bird. Don't you see that on the cover, look. Sketches again, we love sketches. Look at that one. Pretty, it's cool as well, look. Oh, I love that. Especially love a little outfit. How could you pick?
click between those two. Totally different, but both beautiful. I love that. Oh, cool. <laughs> Look at these little thumbnails. Fun. These are fun. Oh, nice shapes as well. I like that. Really nice shapes. Got another fun one. I think this is my favouritest. One of these books, digital painting technique books. Cool. Speed painting techniques. monster. A monster on the loose. Ah, it's a little... what is it? Like a, yeah, like a little... some sort of monster thing. Look at the quality of that. That's cool. I like that. That's cool as well. Yeah, I like that. All these little thumbnails. Very interesting, this. Mythological creatures. I like this. What a cool character. The sketches. Definitely looks better that way. Yeah, I like that. Oh, cool. Oh, look at these, look. Oh, I like that. Huh? That is really cool, that. Super scary. Really like that. Yay! Oh, that's nice. Some sort of water creature. Oh, that's cool. Hmm. Almost looks like a friendly monster. Little mo look. It's like something out of Resident Evil. We've got another AI robot artist. Oh, I don't like. I don't like scary things like that. But. <laughs> Oh, I love the angle. That's cool. Matte painting. I believe this is where they merge photos with paintings. Again, probably something you should try at least once. Just to see what, what it feels like. Is there any is that a painting or is it two photos merged? It's weird.
that's quite hard to do. It'd be quite fun to sort of get, you could get like your house. <laughs> yeah, you could get your house and put it into a, into a painting. That'd be quite fun, I think. Or you could get like photos of your family or something. Look at all these layers, look. Oh, I like that. Yeah, I like that. It all feels together now. Love that. Yeah, it's a tsunami. I want to see the finished one. I love that. Like the colours look. Create a post earthquake city. Again, they're using photos. Merging photos with. I don't know, are they doing. This is matte painting again, isn't it? God, that's good. That's cool. I like that. Swampy setting. Nice feelings about that one. You can almost sort of like smell the environment there. Smell the swampiness. Oh, that's nice. Fantasy forests. Interesting little character. Yay! Little Dennis's favourite. Gallery. Doing. That's interesting. I like that. Hey. That's cool as well. Look at that. It's like um mass effect. That's cool. That must have taken ages. That's nice. I love that. I like that as well. Nice shapes. Watches, that's called. Little watches. Oh, look at this, look. Have a nice day. <laughs> that's a cool name. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like this one as well. It's like the same, it's very similar styles. What the birds look? Loads of birds. Dirty 30. <laughs> Dirty 30. That ship has seen, seen a lot of action. But it's got a lot of stories to tell. Robot concept. That's a robot. Little spaceman. Spaceman. Ring world. Oh, weird. Look, the planet's on a ring. Imagine that. Cool. Adventure. Spaceman. Hope amidst the ruins. That's cool. That's nice. Oh, I 
I'd like to go there. That is it, South Main. Got a little index, Cinema 4D. Wonder what that is. Explosions. Eyes. We like eyes. I do like that they do that. Search for lots of things. Here's the little artists, look. Hey, he looks a bit like Ayrton Senna. She looks cool. Yay, Crystalara. Oh, he looks like a character. One of the AI robots. How sexy some of these are. Little Pedro. <laughs> it's funny, isn't it? Oh, there's a nice mix of AI robots, females and males in this one. Juan Pablo. Juan Pablo Montoya. <laughs> oh, that's a nice photo. There's quite a lot of AI robots in this one. My favourite series of books, Sketching from the Imagination. I've got that one, and that one, that looks nice. Yeah, they, I love these. I find these really fun. They're, they're more interesting, I think, than, in, than inspiring. It's more like they fascinate me, because I, I, I want to sort of... It makes my mind start trying to work out what's going on you're looking at the process of things. Love that one. I think that's my favourite. It's really cool. Well I hope you enjoyed that. It was a look at volume 7 of the Digital Painting Techniques book by 3D Total Publishing and I'll see you later for another one.